We start with one of our charts. Just so I want to give a quick update. If you refer to my last analysis when the price was here, we mentioned how we can look for trade because we mentioned that we are looking at this one. As a flat, we can look for one move up and whoever get the trade for buy right now, they should move their sub loss to break even. And mostly they should take out the trade. They don't have opportunity to move their sub loss to break even. Because we mentioned if we wanted to look for buy, we, the only things we discuss about this. And we, there was opportunity to look for buy based on 15 minutes. Right now they should take out the trade. And we, because if this one turned to flat, right, as if one, two, three, and relative to this, the next drop, even we can expect the price drop to 1.47. Anyway, we have to wait. We don't need to look for any trade either before buy or sell at this point. And we move to daily chart because based on daily chart, we have been looking for this one as a flat. And we mentioned we were looking for buy. And with the breakout of 2.2, we're looking for 2.5. Right now, we want to see whether the price can break 2.5 or not. Because if we put this top in relative to the previous one, and if we refer to the indicators, we see we have a divergence, all right? And since the price broke the previous top, now the possibility for this one turn to a more complex correction is really high. That's why if we want to look for buy, we have to see the breakout of this one. Then from there, we confirm how high it can go, all right? And based on daily chart, we don't have any trade for buy. And if we move to one hour chart, the best thing is if we move, to, uh, right now we are based on four hour chart. The best thing is if we move to, one hour chart, all right? No, we don't have any trade set up. If the price continue flowing by flag, we can look for sell with the stop loss above the top and the targets with the breakout of 1.7, we can look for 1.47, all right? But at this point, we don't have any trade set up for either for buy or sell. And uh, we have to wait. If this one turned to a correction similar to this, we can look for continuation. But any trade for buy within this range, we need to be really careful. But as we can see, the price is dropping. We have to wait. If we get the flag, then we can look for sell. Simply, we will not take the trade. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any opportunity, either for buy or sell, I will share. But at this point, we have to wait since we don't have any trades at all. And again, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.